Hello everyone and welcome back to another part of the animal series here on storyb.space. Now today we're going to be learning everything about tigers and we can start off with this wonderful cute image of two cartoon tigers. So moving on to the first page. Tigers are the largest cat species in the world. Now these aren't your normal cute cuddly house cats they're classified as large wild cats. And by looking at this image of a very cool tiger to the right, you can tell that they're natural born predators and they're very independent. Now the next page tells us about a tiger's lifespan. Tigers live between 20 to 26 years in the wild. Now this may not seem like much compared to you and I because we're humans, but in an animal's world, this is a very long time. And they live the longest when they're in the wild and thriving and preying on other small animals and being a part of the food chain, which is why we do not want to keep them in zoos. Adult tigers generally live alone. Now, remember when I mentioned about tigers being very independent and unlike your cute, cuddly cat friends? Well, Judging by the picture to the right and its fierce look in its eyes, you can tell that these are very independent creatures who are very strong and powerful on their own, and they're able to survive all by themselves. An adult Amur or Siberian tiger, the largest subspecies, can weigh up to 660 pounds. So yes, these are large cats, and by large I mean very, very large. They need all of that body weight and body fat and muscle in order to sustain their health and keep on surviving in the wild. And let's just admire this beautiful picture of a tiger. It just looks so magnificent, so ethereal. Tigers can jump up to 10 meters in length. Now this is a very long distance and they're usually using this ability when hunting prey especially when they're pouncing on small animals in order to get food and survive. Terrorized and feared in many different climes since ancient times, the tiger is adapted to a variety of environments such as the Siberian taiga, where nights can reach 40 degrees Celsius. So tigers are independent and powerful for a reason. They're very feared both among the animal kingdom and among humans too. So they can survive in very cold climates and this just goes to prove again how independent they are and how amazing their survival abilities are. Tigers are great swimmers and actually like the water. So contrary to popular belief, cats do not like water at all, but tigers, which is a large cat species, actually enjoys the water, as you can see from this picture of a tiger looking at its own reflection and being as beautiful as always. Tigers communicate using scent markings, visual signals, and sounds. So tigers have a very strong sense of smell and they communicate this way uh, while also use using visual signals and also sounds. Uh, tigers can make very loud sounds as a form of communication. Cubs are born blind and only open their eyes one to two weeks after birth. So yes, cubs cannot see anything at all once they're born and will have to wait one to two weeks before slowly gaining their vision and thus their ability to survive and hunt. Cubs start learning to hunt at six months of age. Wow, what were you up to at six months? Because I know I was probably in bed at home playing with some blanket or some Legos. But tigers are very different from humans and they develop their hunting skills at a very young age. So six months, not even a year old, way younger than both you and I. And they are already learning the basics of survival. And that's it. I hope you had so much fun learning all about tigers. And I hope that you can develop an interest in these animals just as I did. And remember to admire them, but most importantly, protect them.